Welcome back to the channel. I got another video for y'all today. And today I want to have a conversation with y'all boys. I know a lot of y'all are wondering, can you still have fun on your self-improvement journey? And a lot of y'all are wondering if you can go out to these places, if you can do these things in life while still being on your purpose and while still self-improving yourself. I'm gonna start this video off by saying, if your priorities are not in order, you should not be having fun, bro. As men, you should have all your priorities straight and you should know what you're doing in life. If you are broke, if you are out of shape, if you are not where you wanna be at in life, you should not be having fun at all. See, a lot of y'all make these things complicated and they're not as complicated as you make them seem. If you are not where you want to be at in life, you should not be having fun. And it's okay, bro. There's nothing wrong with that. You're not a weirdo. You're not going to miss out on anything. You just have to put the work in. Whether that takes you three months, whether that takes you a year, however long it takes for you to be alone by yourself, no distractions, and just build yourself from the ground up. You need to do that. You need to go through that, bro. All of these successful people and all of the people that you look up to, including me, they go through a period in their life where they have nobody. They're just alone. They're alone and they're isolated and they just grinding their ass off. You need that in your life, bro, because your priorities are not in order. See, a lot of y'all are prioritizing fun more than you're prioritizing your goals, more than you're prioritizing your life. See, a lot of y'all think fun is life. A lot of y'all think going to parties, drinking all the time, just doing this BS is living life. That is not living life. Living life is getting to the next level every single year. Constant self-improvement, constant bettering yourself every single day. I say this all the time, bro. If you are not leveling up, if you are not moving forward every single day, you are behind, you're taking two steps backwards. So before you try and go have fun, just remember where you are, where you are in life right now. If you are not where you want to be at, bro, you need to lock in. You need to be fucking focused, bro, because these things that you're going to, these things that you're participating in, they're taking your energy away from the main goal. All of your energy has to be to your fucking success. You cannot say you want this shit, bro, but it's 50-50. Some days you go work on it, then some days you party. Some days you want to promote your business, and some days you promoting something else. You have to be all in with it, bro. You have to be all in with it and make no excuses and stop distracting yourself. You are the only one. You are the only one who gets up and go to that party. You are the only one who participates in things that are destroying your success. So when you realize that, that's when you're gonna start self-improving. That's when you're gonna start getting to the next level in life. There's nothing wrong with having fun, don't get me wrong, but have fun when it's actually time to have fun. A lot of y'all are trying to have fun right now for what? You didn't do shit, you didn't accomplish anything in life, but you wanna sit up every single day and party. What sense does that make? You didn't put in no work, but you want the reward right now. You want that instant gratification. And it is hurting you, bro. A lot of y'all cannot put the work in first and then get what you want in life. It's always give me, give me, give me right now. That's not how that shit works, bro. First you put the work in and then you have the fun. If you steady having fun every day, destroying your body, destroying your health, you are never going to get where you want to be at in life. Like I said, you cannot make any excuses. At first, bro, you're not going to be able, and a lot of y'all are having questions about this balance shit. Oh, Tavon, what about balance? When you first start off with whatever you try to do, business, YouTube, selling clothes, whatever it is, those first couple of months, bro, you need to be all the way in. There is no fun. 
If you really want to get yourself off of the ground, if you really want to make a name for yourself, bro, you have to be locked in those first couple. I'm not even going to say months. That first year, you need to be locked in with whatever you're doing. No parties, no woman, no none of that. Just you in the fucking grind. And you should do that every single day until you're in a position where you can go out and have some fun. I'm not saying take your foot off the gas, but it's healthy to go out and interact with people. It's healthy to go out and enjoy yourself, bro. Like, don't, don't think of self-improvement. Don't think of the hustle, the grind as something that's, you know, bad. Something that you don't want to do. You should wake up every single day and enjoy life and enjoy the process. If you waking up every day dragging your feet, bro, you're not doing this shit right. You have to wake up excited. You have to wake up excited to do the things that you're supposed to do in this life. Because to me, that's fun too, bro. Last night, I stayed up until like 2 o'clock. I was with one of the homies. We went to this little event, chopping it up with a couple of people. We went to the gym right after that. We got to the gym around like 10 o'clock, worked out. Came home and I was chilling. Ate me some pizza and I was chilling. Woke up at six o'clock this morning, bro, and got straight to it. See, a lot of y'all can't do that yet. A lot of y'all can't focus on your priorities and have fun at the same time. That's why I'm telling you, that's exactly why I'm telling you to take a year to yourself, a couple of months to yourself to put that work in. Because me, I'm not making any excuses, bro. The things that I tell myself I'm going to do every single day, I'm going to do that shit, bro, regardless of what happened. Yeah, I stayed up late last night, but I'm going to still get up early because I want this shit. I prioritize this shit, bro. This is not something I just do on the weekends, on the weekdays. I'm just part-time with it. No, bro. I have my whole entire heart into this. So I'm focused. When you're really passionate about something, bro, you should be focused on it. A lot of y'all are just half-assing this shit. It's going to take your full energy to get to where you want to be at in life. It's going to be times where you can have fun, but have fun at the right times, bro. How are you having fun right now and you're broke? You have no money. You can't even pay for the meals that you're going out and getting. And then you go right back home. You broke. You just spend your last on some food. And now you got to go right back to work. And the same cycle just repeats itself. Go to work. I'm broke. Go to work. I'm broke. Go to work. I'm broke. Who wants to live like that, bro? Do you? Are you really telling me? You sitting here telling me that what you're doing right now is going to get you to your goals. You really sitting here telling me that what you're doing right now is going to change the situation that you've been in for years. Can you have fun on self-improvement? Ask yourself this question, bro. Is the things you're doing right now hurting you to get to your goals or helping you to get to your goals? It is simple as that. And if you find yourself not able to get one foot ahead of each other, because you keep taking footsteps back, then maybe it's time to stop doing those things. Maybe it's time to sacrifice some things and actually go hard for what you want in this life. Because to me, bro, working on myself is fun. Getting higher and elevating myself is fun. Because you get to see your true potential. A lot of y'all don't see y'all true potential, bro, because you're lost in the fucking world. You're lost in the sauce. You don't know who you are as a person. You don't know what you like to do. And you don't know what you can do. Because you always around these distractions. You always around these people who bring out the worst in you. If you really want to self-improve, if you really want to better your life, you need to be around people who bring out the best in you, who bring out the savage in you, who tell you when you're fucking up and tell you when you're doing good. You need those type of people in your life. You don't need a bunch of yes men in your life. 
Every time you do something dumb, they're patting you on the back. You don't need that. If you ever find yourself in that situation, bro, get you some new friends. If you always find yourself always being right, you need to get you some new friends because you're not always right. You're not always going to know what the fuck is going on. That's why you need to have somebody in your life that's going to tell you that you messing up, bro. That's going to tell you not to go to that party. That's going to tell you to work on your business. That's going to tell you to hustle. So if you want to change your life, bro, change your friends, change your environment, change the things that you are doing on a constant basis. But I hope this video answered y'all question, bro. Can you have fun on your self-improvement journey? Yes. But you have to learn what to prioritize and what not to prioritize. This is the end of this video for y'all today. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe to this video or subscribe to the channel, my bad. And leave a comment down below, man. I'm going to reply to y'all comments. We out. I love y'all. And we out.